Hi, my name is Mark Patterson. I'm with Go Measure 3D, and today I'm going to show you how to take a CAD model and compare it to a scan, scanned object in uh, Geomagic Control. So let's start. First thing you're going to want to do is make sure that your capture is enabled. So we'll go down to Options and Digitizers and take a look up at Plugins and Geomagic Capture Zone. So press OK. And we're going to come to the Capture tab and go to Scan. And we're going to take a look at it, adjust the exposure, and scan it. All right, it looks like the mesh is good, so we're going to press OK. And the next thing we need to do is align them together. So we're going to come over to the scan and right click and set it to test. And that will allow us to best fit. So we're going to best fit these and I'm going to click apply and it will take care of that for me. Looks good. Press OK. And the next thing we want to do is we want to look at a 3D compare. And so we're going to apply that. And we can see the deviation between the scan data and the CAD model. And we're going to click OK. Next thing we want to look at is a 2D compare. And what we're really looking at is a comparison between the CAD model and the point cloud. Um, so we're going to go ahead and hit Compute and take a look at that. Looks OK. So press OK. And the next thing we want to do is we want to take some dimensions off of uh, between that 2D model and the point cloud. So we have to do a section through object. And we're just going to do the same thing. Draw a line right down the center of it. And click Compute. Take a look at it. Looks good. So press OK. And now we can do 2D dimensions. And let's take a look at the radius here of this little shoulder on the bottom. And you can see it there. And we can look at some other things on this. Uh, you have uh, horizontal, vertical, diameters, parallel. So there are a lot of things that we can do uh, as far as dimensioning. But for the moment, we're just going to do that one. and. Now we're going to see about a report. So you want to go to reports, create report, and Geomagic Control will automatically create a report for you with everything that you just did in it. And we'll wait for that to come up. Alright, and there's our report. Um, looks good. You can see all the deviations from it. Uh, and scroll down, it will show more data and the deviations between the point cloud. And that's it. Thanks for watching.